As Hockey East enters its eighth year, it's really no surprise that this league is dominant nationwide. In the recent Albany Times Union Bowl, Hockey East has three teams in the top ten. Sitting on the top of the ladder for the third straight week is the University of Maine Black Bears. Seventh-year head coach Sean Walsh has led his team so far to a 3 and mark, the latest of which came last Sunday at the County Forum, a 4 nothing shutout of B.C. Martin keeping it in, off now for Pellerin, drops it across, they work it down, oh, got the score! Patrice Tardif, taking the pass right Center up. Patrice Tardif knocks two goals in that game, making him the league's leading scorer. Attempt to stop this, tries to catch Snow on the other side. And Brentham Mask goalie, Gar Snow, stopped 26 shots, earning him Hockey East Player of the Week honors. Another local won Rookie of the Week honors. BC freshman Sal Maganaro of North Quincy scored the game winner in BC's 3-1 win over Merrimack and notched his second goal in the 7-4 loss against RPI. The Eagles and coach Len Siglarski are off to a 2-4 and four start. But for those who may have some doubts, fret no more. As despite a 2-4 start back in 89-90, BC did wind up among the NCAA Final Four. Mike McShane's Friars are on a winning track as they swept Denver over the weekend. While netminder Brad Mulhahey nurses an injury, sophomore netminder Mike Henke has been stellar in goal. Played both games of a Denver doubleheader. Made a combined 42 saves on 47 shots. Senior center Mike Boback also played put up strong numbers in those games with two goals and five assists. Eight seconds to go in the game. Two teams who are holding their own of late are Merrimack and UMass Lowell. These two tribes put on an impressive show last Wednesday night on Nesson and particularly in the net. Out in front alone is O'Connell and he's robbed by DeMore. Dan O'Connell. Chris taken away by Agostino Casale. Gravel though had the stick lifted by O'Connell. Weinrich's oh, shot is blocked out by Rollison. The Warriors' senior wing, Agostino Casale, notched a goal and had an assist in that game. Currently leads the nation with his 10 goals. But his effort just wasn't enough as the new-look UMass Lowell Chiefs squeak by with a 5-4 win. Lastly, the Northeastern Huskies. With new coach Ben Smith have certainly not been laying down on the job. They sport a 3-1 record as well as an impressive array of talent. Strong game, getting it back for McNair, who's off the mark. They long for Kenny, scores! Rob Kenny, second of the hockey game, third of the season. And it's 4-0 Northeast. Don't look for this team to claim the seller rights this year. These hounds may be nipping at a first division finish.